Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. Recently I bought a few stationery items from some Etsy shops and I thought I'd show you guys. If you guys know of any really good stationery shops I could try out, please let me know in the comments. So I'm starting off by making myself some chocolate chai tea. What do you guys think of my mug? I think it's really cute and encompasses the name of this channel pretty well. So this whole summer I've been boycotting Amazon and I've been looking for some stationery from other independent sellers. So currently we have so many options of where to buy things and many of us choose Amazon because it's the most accessible and it's very easy to find it. But if you just take some time to look around you'll be surprised at what other things you could find. So in this video, I've got two packages. The white package is from Ginkgo Supplies, and this blue one is from Fairy Milk Bar. I will definitely link the shops in the description box if you guys want to check them out. I'm starting off with the package from Ginkgo Supplies. So the first thing I pulled out was this memo pad. So I use memo pads religiously. I always run low on them. I really like the positive mood this creates and I love the simplicity of it. I really like the hearts they added for the check marks. The next thing I got was from the same line of memo notes. This one is significantly longer, has more places to write things down, and it has a really cute star astronaut theme. I also bought this avocado sticky notepad. I also invested in some really cute washi tape. This one is a yellow plaid. This will be perfect with my pen palling. Lastly, I got a set of five different tapes. All of these have a really soft pink and gray vintage vibe to them and I really like it. So this is everything we got from Ginkgo. Next we have my order from Fairy Milk Bar. The first thing I pull out is this weekly memo sheet set. It also comes with a ton of stickers, which I will definitely be using. Next, I got these famous paintings stickers. They're made to look like stamps, which I think is really cool. I'm not gonna lie, I got this because I saw one of Claude Monet's paintings on the box and he's my all-time favorite artist. I've got to hand it to this Etsy store. They have really nice packaging and it's really enjoyable. As soon as I saw this washi tape on their store, I knew I had to get it. My bedding is the exact same pattern and I really like it. I'm pretty sure I was most excited for this item. It's a honey notepad. I think it is so creative, absolutely adorable. I personally really love honey. The inside papers are so simplistic. I'm just in love with it. She also gave me this card with my purchase. I also got these strawberry stickers and they are so pretty. I really like the watercolor effect these strawberries have. Fairy Milk Barn also included a ton of free sticker samples. I was absolutely shocked at the sheer amount of stickers she sent me. The first pack of free stickers she gave me are these European-esque stickers. So this next pack is all about Alice in Wonderland. I actually did not grow up with the Disney adaptation of Alice in Wonderland. I'm actually pretty sure I never even watched it. So I find that these stickers more resemble what I remember seeing. I like that these stickers are sheer so I can not only use them in 
journaling but I can also do resin crafts out of them and I find that they have incredible detail on them too. The third pack of stickers had pets in mugs, well not pets, I guess animals, and it is so adorable. This little deer, I think this one was my favorite, and little sheeps and cats. The last pack was a snow globe pack, and it had this wanderlust feeling towards it. And this was everything I got from Fairy Milk Barn. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know which item was your favorite and I'll see you guys next time.